Hey guys, welcome back to another unboxing video. Today we'll be unboxing the 3,500 pound suspension kit provided by Blue Swift Axles. Let's go ahead and see what it all has to offer. So first thing we've got here are the equalizers for this tandem axle suspension setup. And then we have the bolts for the shackles, the hangers, equalizers, all the same. And then the self-locking nuts that go along with them. Then we have our shackles and then our hangers, both hangers for the leaf springs and the hanger for the equalizers and then lastly the leaf springs themselves overall pretty much everything you'll need for a full suspension makeover so let's go ahead clear off this table and start assembling it so now that i've got one half of the suspension here on the table we can start assembling and what i like to do is always start off with the equalizer here and with this equalizer there's not going to be a specific front and back so it can go either way and it'll be pre-fitted with these nylon bushings. So we'll start off with that here, and then you'll obviously have your suspension equalizer hanger welded to the bottom of the frame. And with these hangers, well, they're all gonna be the same in this kit because of the width of the equalizer and the springs is gonna be the same. So you'll take this, which is welded to the frame, Slide your equalizer up into it, and you'll take one of these bolts here, run it through. Then you'll take your nut, which are self locking, so they go on only one specific way, and thread it on the back here. Then you can start to install the leaf springs on the hangers because it's easier to install your leaf springs then bring them up and slide them into the shackles so you'll take the rear leaf spring slide it up into the hanger slide your bolt through will be hammered the rest of the way in Take your self-locking nut, put it on the back there, rest the hanger like that, put that back here, and then do the same with the front, making sure that these little clips you see on the spring will be facing the front of the trailer, like that, front hanger. Line through like so. And with all these bolts and nuts, they're going to be torqued to around 65 foot pounds of torque. So now that you have your hangers attached to the leaf springs on your trailer, these leaf springs will obviously be resting down. And so the next step will be to bolt the shackles to your equalizer first. So one on the front, one on the rear, that equalizer. Slide the bolt through. Put the nut on the back there. Do the same thing on the other side. Now, once you have your shackles on, you'll be bringing the leaf strings up into them on the trailer. And so making sure that they are facing up because you don't want your equalizers riding down. So they're facing up. 
and then you'll put your eye between them and slide the bolt through. And now with the second one, it can get tricky. Your equalizer can start to flex down. And so don't be worried if it ends up doing this on you. It can be fixed and you do not have to undo these bolts. So it'll be like this. And you can slide all through with your tackle facing up. And when you're doing this, and the equalizer jolts and flips and shackles around like this, simply take a pry bar, put it between the frame of the trailer and the equalizer here, and just pry down on it. It will flip itself around like that. But once you have both of these shackles, fixed to the springs themselves, and they're both facing up. That completes the assembly and mounting of the 3,500 pound suspension kit to your trailer. And one last thing to remember, when tightening these bolts and nuts on this suspension kit, always make sure to fasten them down and then back them off so that all of these moving points can still pivot in your suspension. Because if you leave them tight, they won't be able to, and you'll be wearing out parts a lot faster. So just make sure to back them off and make sure they are still getting that 65 foot pounds of torque that they need. Now, once you've finished assembling and installing this 3,500 pound, double I tandem axle suspension kit, there's going to be some maintenance and upkeep involved on your end in order to making it last. Some things that you can do include greasing and lubricating the moving components, such as the equalizer bushings and shackles, and also applying grease to the springs themselves in order to preserve the leaves and prevent rust. All right, guys, that's a wrap for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any more questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. I'll be sure to get to those. And don't forget to like and subscribe so we can see more videos like this. We'll catch you in the next one.